Yeah, the beef rush are really nice. Yeah. I live in Cambridge, so like it's just been kind of interesting to see Harvard sort of from the inside because I walk through it multiple times every day. Um, but it's been really cool to sort of like see the insides of the buildings and what goes on in it. There's definitely more energy here, I feel. And um, people are really happy to be at Harvard and no one seems to have regrets that they're here. Everyone at Harvard is really nice. When I when I missed it in Princeton, they were, they were like making fun of Harvard students. But here, like, I don't know how to that. Everyone told me, everyone's like, oh, everyone's going to be so pretentious at Harvard. Everyone's going to be a nerd. Um, you're not going to be able to talk to anyone. And it's totally shattered that, that whole idea. I think for me, I, I mean, to be honest, I really did like Bulldog Days a lot. It was really fun, but there was also the sense that it was, there's so much emphasis on the organizations there because there's not much to do elsewhere. It's different from the Yale weekend in that uh, the Yale one was pretty structured. It had a little more structure to it. It's tough. I think Harvard wins on a lot of categories <laughs> compared to Columbia. Um, the only thing that is like slightly cooler is just how well integrated Columbia is with New York City. Most memorable, I guess, event was yesterday. I went to the like Taiwanese Student Association, and I was expecting to be really like not fit in at all one, because I'm a pre freshman too because I'm not Taiwanese. <laughs> but they were really nice to me, and they were really talkative. My my friend's host put it well that like everybody is just really passionate about something. It's just it's good to see real people and not just go based on the stereotype that you have. What's something bad about Harvard? Um, I mean, the quad's a bit of a walk. But, but oh, from the quad? Yeah. yeah. Least exciting. The weather. <laughs> I have to say, the New England weather. They, Harvard should work on that. I mean, they have enough money to fix that, right?